In this video, I'll show you how to fix internet issues you're having with your Hisense Roku TV. In case your TV is not connecting to your Wi-Fi, or maybe it's connecting, but then disconnecting every few seconds. What you need to do is to take your remote control, press the, um, over here, the home button, go down, select settings. Then you need to select network, select check connection, wait a few seconds. It will scan your Wi-Fi currently Wi-Fi network that you're connected to or that you have trouble connecting to, then press OK. And over here you should see some details about the connection. One of the main problems is over here you see signal strength. Mine is fair, it's not the best, but if yours is poor or even worse than poor, well you know that the problem is just because the TV does not receive your Wi-Fi signal and the signal is not strong enough. So try to bring your router closer to your TV. If you're still having issues, well, what you need to do is to unplug your Hisense TV from the wall socket. Even if the screen was turned on, that doesn't matter. Just unplug it, wait five minutes. During that five minutes, don't just stay there. Go ahead and find the power button of your TV. Usually it's located under it, in the middle or in the right, on the right side. Once you found that button, keep it pressed during 30 seconds. Even if the TV is unplugged, don't worry, just keep it pressed 30 seconds. Next, you're going to plug back your Hisense Roku TV in the wall socket. Do not plug it in a power bar, maybe this was causing your issue. Once you've done this, you're going to power on your TV using the button under that uh, you just pressed previously. Just tap on it once. All right, after the TV screen powers on, you need to go into the settings, then network, set up connection, wireless, and we're just going to reconnect to your Wi-Fi network. Okay, so select your Wi-Fi network from the list, type the password, press connect. And hopefully this will solve your issue. If you're still having problems, what I suggest is that you unplug your Wi-Fi router from the wall socket the same way you just did for your TV. Wait about two or three minutes, plug it back, and sometimes this solves the problem. I know I had it personally, not with this Hisense TV, but with my computer. Simply by unplugging the router and plugging it back, it solved my issue. I don't know why it happened, but it's quite easy to test out this theory by unplugging and plugging back the device. So thanks for watching. I hope this was useful. If so, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.